art can be difficult at times, art can be challenging, and the art blog um, writes in a manner that, that tries to make it accessible to a lot of people. The thing is, is that I look at it, I look at a lot of things, and it's a way to get information that I wouldn't be able to get, um, and it's a local site. Is that it's so comprehensive that I, if I don't have any time, I don't have to read any other blog. So know that you not only read here in the U.S., but you also read abroad, and I know that you read by many, many, many people around the world, which is actually amazing. I consistently champion um, smaller spaces. I think the thing that I really, really, really love about Art Blog is that it considers everything. Um, all of the other opportunities that I have to read about things consider commercial galleries or museums. What Art Blog does is the universe of the arts in Philadelphia. Cities are for the creation of culture, cities of the 21st century. And um, I, I think it's playing out here. And the Art Blog is right on top of that, and I value it for that. What's interesting is reading the reviews, of course, if it's a show that I'm interested in, or reading a review about something I know nothing about. And what's great about our blog is it tells you everything. A, a voice of the of what's happening in the city culturally at this moment. Like the most about it is the very diversifying coverage of the arts, visual arts community and all of its diversity. It's not just traditional art forms, but uh, a lot of the things that um, have grown out of and to become part of the uh, visual arts field. I talk to a lot of things and I see a lot of things. I can't see and do everything. So I can find out about things I'm missing by going to the art blog. Thank you.